Ahoy, you scurvy skellywags. In today's video, I'm going to show you everything you need to know about how to use fire in the Sea of Thieves to further your pirate ambition of treasure. So sit back, grab some grog, and let's have our pirate conversation. Well, mateys, the moment we have all been waiting for is finally here. Fire! Now the question is, in what ways can we use fire for our advantage on the seas? Now before I show you all the different ways you can use it, the first question is, where do you find them? Well, the simple answer is, you can't have them, I have taken them all and I plan on using them. I mean, uh, you... You can find them around the world of the Sea of Thieves, just like the cursed cannonballs. So make sure to always look in those barrels and collect these beautiful, beautiful fire bombs. Now let's jump into some of the ways that you can use them and how fire works in the seas. That's right mates, everything can come ablaze. Pirates, ships, and skeletons can all be set on fire. But how does this fire start, you ask? Well, fortunately for all of you, fires can start a lot of different ways. Explosions from kegs, lightning, aye, that is right, lightning can start fires on your ship and catch you on fire as well. It's also still pretty dangerous to get hit by those lightning strikes, so make sure you always have something to help you heal. And of course, fire bombs can catch you on fire, and if you dare to venture into the Devil's Roar, the volcanoes can really make your ship shine and not in the good way. Even the seas themselves can catch on fire. I mean, uh, uh, okay, not, not everything catches on fire, but you understand what I'm trying to say. We now have throwable fire bombs at our disposal, which means all you fire happy pyromaniacs, you are going to have an awesome time with these. Probably the simplest and the best way to use these new fire bombs is to just simply throw them. You can equip these new fire bombs through the radial dial and use them against your enemies, skeletons, ships, and so, so much more. You can even throw them at your teammate who isn't helping at all on the ship and just playing music while you're doing all the work. So for all you pirates out there that don't help, there's now a way to, well, light a fire underneath you if you get what I'm trying to say. Another fine use for these little beauties are loading them into cannons and shooting them at your unsuspecting enemies. The same bomb that you throw is the same bomb that you load into the cannon. Needless to say, there are a lot of uses for them, so if you're coming up on an enemy ship and you want to give them something to worry about, well, make sure to load these firebombs into your cannon and they won't know what to do with it. What makes these firebombs especially good against ships is it can catch the whole ship on fire, including the masts. So it really adds a new element of combat to the seas that you need to be aware of. Aye, that is right, matey. Sometimes you need a quick snack on the go while you're running around the island. Well, all you have to do now is throw one of these at a snake, a pig, or even Larry the chicken, and they will drop either a cooked or burned meat for you to eat. This even works for those unfortunate animals that may be caught in a cage. Either way, just remember, you need a quick snack, use a firebomb. Sometimes after a long day of thieving, you just want to make a campfire and swap stories of all your adventures. Well, now you can light a campfire very easily. Building one is no problem, all you need is a bit of wood and you are good to go. However, something you may want to keep in mind is that these new campfires let up smoke into the sky letting other pirates know exactly where you are and this smoke can be seen from quite the distance. So light these up at your own risk. Or if you're a crafty pirate of sorts, you could always use this to your advantage as a decoy. Either way, something to keep in mind. All this fire talk reminds me though, for all you pirates out there that may not know, the best way to put a fire out is to use water. Our ships are now equipped with new water barrels that you can use to get water, so just in case your ship is on fire, or maybe you cook something a little too long and it caught your ship on fire, or maybe, just maybe, you accidentally throw a firebomb at your mate, and now you need to put a fire out, well, this water barrel can save your life. 
Another thing to take note of is if you find yourself accidentally catching yourself on fire, or maybe another pirate decides to use a firebomb against you, well, you can take a bucket of water and douse yourself with it. So a pro tip here, it is now going to be super beneficial to always have water in your bucket, so whenever you get a chance, make sure to fill that bucket up with water. It could save your life. Well, mates, that is all I have for you. I hope all of you pyromaniacs enjoy this new mechanic in RCs because I know I sure will. And make sure to let me know in the comments below what way you plan to use fire first. Until then, mates, I hope to see you out on the seas.